Hello everybody, if you're wondering why I'm looking weird, I have um, my eyes done, but not underneath my eyes, I have no brows on and my foundation and my ear not done, it's because today I'm doing a first impressions of their um, Makeup Revolutions Conceal and Define Concealer. This is the first time today I'm using this concealer. And this is super sized. You can also get the smaller one, which retails for five pounds. This retails for nine pounds. Super affordable concealer. And I'm gonna put it to the test and see how I like it. So, I'm just going to apply it under the eyes. My face looks super white because I'm sure this foundation is way too light for me. I'm a lot tanned than what my face is, like the foundation. Start by putting a triangle underneath the eyes to conceal. I think this is a good match of concealer because I like my concealer very bright. Do I like the under eyes? See how it blends out. Blending out quite. If you're wondering why I keep looking there, is that I got a mirror there and I'm seeing what I'm doing because I can't see properly because I'm filming with my phone. I'm just blending out the concealer. It adds really, really full coverage. I would say this is um, a full coverage concealer. And some people compare this to the... To the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. I've never ever had the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. It's really hard to get in the UK. So I've never had the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. So I can compare. But they do have a big Doford applicator. Just like the Tarte Shape Tape. What I've seen people use it online. Just um. It blends out really nicely. Really really nice. As you can see, that concealer is blended out super nice, super full coverage. I'm going to highlight the centre of the forehead, what I usually do with concealer. Down the bridge of the nose. This is like the places I usually conceal and highlight. Be honest, this is a very, very decent concealer. Like for, um, in America they call it drugstore, but in England... I'd have said, like it's a good affordable concealer. But I had a feeling I was going to really like this concealer. A lot, I don't know why. Hello guys, I'm back with my brows and underneath my eyes done. I'm going to be setting underneath my eyes to see how the concealer sets. I'm using um, the Makeup Revolution Imagination Palette. I don't think you can get this anymore. Set underneath the eyes with the two lighter colours. Excuse me, the, my baby's in the background. <laughs> That's my daughter. My daughter, she's trying to play with my makeup. So anyway, I'm setting underneath the eyes to see how it sets with the Real Techniques setting brush. The line of people are moving together and trying to create the effect of a centipede. Set all the places where I put the concealer. To be honest, I'm really, really, really am shocked with this concealer. It's absolutely amazing. Like, for say it's so cheap, it looks a lot more than what it is. Might as well do the rest of my face on camera, even though I'm just like filming about the concealer, really. I'm using um, Ula Caramel to warm up my face because I look very pale.
Add a bit of colour back to my face because the foundation I used is way too light for my skin. That looks a bit better. Now I'm going to contour with this palette. This video is only about like review on this concealer, but I thought I might as well do the rest of my face on camera. You can just feel your heart beating and it's really fun. Hello guys, so I'm back and um, I've done the rest of my face and um, I've got dressed. So anyway, this is the um, concealer I've been reviewing. I highly, highly, highly recommend this concealer. A super decent, good, affordable drugstore concealer. So thank you so much for watching and please subscribe to my channel if, if you haven't and please click the notification bell. And thank you so much for watching.